Shocking discovery in California. Federal authorities uncovering a massive and sophisticated drug tunnel near San Diego running underground to Tijuana. Millions of dollars in drugs seized. Three suspects now in custody. ABC's Pierre Thomas is in Washington. Has more on that for us. Good morning, Pierre. Good morning, Robin. It's an epic game of cat and mouse between the U.S. government and the Mexican cartels. We're about to show folks at home something that will give them a sense of the incredible scale and scope of drug running at the southern border. It is perhaps the most elaborate drug smuggling tunnel ever uncovered. It was designed to move illegal narcotics by the ton. It has electricity, a ventilation system so smugglers can breathe comfortably underground and an extraordinary electronic rail system to transport drugs. Built by engineers and architects. They're sophisticated, they're high tech. The tunnel begins in a Tijuana, Mexico warehouse, snaking its way underground across the border to this building in an industrial complex outside of San Diego. It is four feet high and three feet wide, spanning more than a third of a mile long, six football fields in length. These so-called super tunnels are capable of moving massive amounts of drugs. In this case, authorities seized more than eight tons of marijuana and hundreds of pounds of cocaine destined for the U.S., valued at more than $12 million. They intended to move a large amount of narcotics through this tunnel, and before they could even get one pound of narcotics into this country, they were stopped. This is the eighth drug smuggling tunnel detected in the San Diego area since 2006. A similar tunnel was found just two years ago, only blocks away from the new one. More than 75 tunnels along the southwest border have been discovered since 2008. Robin, when you see these tunnels, you truly understand that the multi-million dollar corporations in Mexico are huge. And you get a sense that Americans smoke a hell of a lot of weed. No. Robin? All right, Pierre, on both fronts.